Thanks, Brad. Well, happening now at 6, gruesome pictures coming to light after a vicious brawl breaks out in the middle of a soccer game. Tonight, one of the victims, a young mother, describes being punched and stomped on at Elon Park in Valentine. She was among three people sent to the hospital. A 15-year-old has been charged with assault, but the victims want more arrests. NBC Charlotte's Alex Shabbat is at the park with the new details. We're learning from one of those victims. Well, one of the victims showed me her significant injury. She says she was brutally attacked right in front of her four-year-old son, all because someone didn't like the ref's decision. The girl kicked me twice with her cleats on my face. These brutal injuries are soccer related. They kicked me on my chest. But not in the way you might think. They pulled my fingernails off my hands. Two fingernails viciously ripped off. Doctors say they may never grow back. Karen Valida describing the brawl sending her and two others to the hospital. She says it started when this 15 year old girl got upset over a referee's decision. He didn't blow the whistle and um, that's when she got mad. She then allegedly assaulted Valida's aunt, who was involved in the play. I baked them apart, and she started hitting me. So that's when I hit her back as self-defense. That's when all her entire family started hitting me, punching me. Soon, she estimates 20 people were involved. When they hit me in my face, when they kicked me in my face, they could have just killed me right there. All of it unfolding in front of her four-year-old son. It sucks that we have to go through this. Over a soccer game. The 15 year old girl identified in this picture by the victim now facing two assault charges. We have chosen not to identify her, but Valida's sister pushing for other arrests. We're going to get a lawyer. We're going to fight this case. We have enough witness to fight this case. And I want the whole entire team to be arrested because everyone was involved. But police say the victims would have to get warrants from a magistrate first. CMPD says they've identified other suspects in the case and more charges are possible. In Charlotte, Alex Shabad, NBC. See Charlotte.